Kitchen shears are an essential part of any cook's knife kit. We use them for a wide range of tasks, like cutting twine, snipping herbs, and butterflying chicken, just to name a few. We tested six pairs of kitchen shears and we rated them in two categories, performance and ease of use. Here are the highlights. All right, so we've got our twine here and we are going to snip through them. Oh, worked well, that pretty was well. <laughs> yeah, this is good. Nice and sharp, that seems like. I have lots of thoughts on these that aren't. They cut the twine fine. Yeah. I'll leave it at that for now. All right, so all of these were able to snip twine. This is admittedly a very easy test. There are some shears out there that can't do it, though. You might have one in your kitchen drawers right now. Um, but all these six, they were fine at twine. So let's move on. So I'm just cutting off the, the ends that don't look so great. These are doing pretty well. I think there's really only a very short area of these blades that is the business yeah. end oh. right here. So I'm kind of lining them up. That's sort of okay because it's precise, but if I was trying to cut bigger amounts of things, it's hard to open your hands up wide enough to use the full extent of these blades, which is a bit stumpy. It's about two inches. These are the Shun multi-purpose shears, and they are opening a lot wider, and there's more blade length here. Um, so it's easier to not have to be working just at the very tip here. Longer blades. Longer blades and a little bit of exoration here. Cool. Oh. Kind of like slipped. Did yeah, you see I that? See kind of like do a little thing where it turned on the stem. Okay, so these are the all clad shears. Um, I'm going to cut some rosemary and I'm going to cut it right down by the woody part of the stem and see how that does. Yeah. Kind of bends and then. Yeah, slips. yeah. It's not, it's not effortless, which is what you really want. All right, so this is one of our favorite uses of kitchen shears because they provide some really nice muscle to cut through chicken bones. Would you like to do the honors? Yes, I have the Shun All Purpose Shears. Wow, I feel like I'm cutting through paper. That was awesome. That was so easy. With a knife, you know, you really have to like crunch through and you're not cutting from both sides. They're, they're a little bit fat, these blades, and so when you're making the cuts, you really have to pull them apart. It didn't seem to get as wide. Yeah, it has these little micro serrations on the blade and I think it grabbed the chicken pretty well, but it didn't feel quite as comfortable. It kind of slipped off there. Did you see that? Yeah. Oh my goodness. It just know, went, whoop. Like, whoop. <laughs> like I'm trying to cut in and it's coming back at me. All of the shears sailed through the easier tasks. But when we challenged them to cut tougher, denser, more slippery foods, some of these shears just didn't cut it. Hilarious, Lisa. All right, let's go on to our final round, ease of use. We have a beautiful pie dough rolled out, but as you can see, there's some overhang here and we need to trim this up. This is a really cool test because you want scissors that feel really dexterous because you're cutting, moving, going around a round surface. So I have the J.A. Henkels here. Okay. Let's see how this feels. How does that feel? Ah, it feels really good, actually. It's really cutting neatly. It doesn't feel like you're able to do little tiny pieces and bigger pieces and it's not stretching or distending the dough in any way. So, Hannah, these are the OXO shears and we've traced the bottom of the cake pan on a circle there in our parchment. And we're gonna see how well they work and how they feel. How are the blades? Good, nice and sharp. Tension feels right. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we found some of these where you're opening and closing and they're very difficult. Or on the flip side, way too loose and they don't have any, they don't help you at all. Mm -hmm. How's that? Nice, it dropped right in, looks beautiful. The tension's a little tight in these. They just feel a little stiff. Still cutting here for the rest of my life. All right, here we are with another test, a cauliflower, which may seem like a bizarre usage for kitchen shears, but actually this really gets at, an, at the agility again. And have you ever cut up a cauliflower and the little teeny little white bits get everywhere? This will make it much tidier. So, I have a shun here. Let's see, I'm, I'm not even going to use a knife at all. I'm mm -hmm. just going to go right at it. These are nice and long. They have such long blades mm -hmm. that I could really like get into all these weird spaces and trim this flat. The real test, I don't know if it's going to be able to do this. Can I hack, hack off the entire stem? Oh, Whoa. that was so easy. <laughs> wow. So how do those feel for just general ease of use? These are great. Uh, okay. The tension is perfect. It's even the whole time. You know, it's mm -hmm. nice and even, not too loose, not too tight. And big finger bows, I got plenty of room to grip in there. 
slightly, you know, some sort of plasticky coating on here, so it's not that hard steel, so I'm a little protected. Um, this did really well. That's great. Well done, Shen. It's, ow. It's, it hurts right here. It's an ow on the first I know. cut. Oh my gosh. It's because you really, you need to brace yourself against there to use the scissors, and it's just, it's just a hard metal edge. This is super easy. They're pretty comfortable. How do the bows feel? The bows are a little bit hard, a uh, little, but not bad. Pretty good. Generally, we like shears with roomy finger bows and medium weight shears of about four to five ounces. Of the six we tested, one pair stood a cut above the rest. Lisa? The Shun multi-purpose shears. They were our favorite. They could handle anything we threw at them. They were comfortable to use and really made every job a lot easier. We also had a Best Buy, the J.A. Henkel's International Take Apart Kitchen Shears. They performed really well too. They just weren't quite as powerful as our winner. For more information on our winning shears and all the other shears we tested, check out the links below. Make sure to ask us your kitchen shear questions in the comments and don't forget to hit that subscribe button.